In February 2004, serious test drives of the Alika began at a track in Tochigi Prefecture. The car was driven by Formula One veteran Ukio Katayama. 400 kilometers per hour is even higher than the speeds reached in Formula One. How fast can the Alika really go? Will the motors and inverters function properly? The only way to find out is to drive the car at high speed. Most electric vehicles produced until now have been special purpose vehicles like golf carts. They're not intended to travel fast or over long distances. The Alika is ready to shatter the perception that electric cars are quiet and eco-friendly, but no fun to drive. An electric car doesn't produce the distinctive rumble of an engine. The Alika sounds more like a jet aircraft as it speeds up. <laughs> but the Alika is economical as well as powerful. If the electricity it uses is calculated in terms of gasoline, the Alika is more than twice as fuel efficient as an engine powered car with the same weight and running performance. Packed with the best of Japanese technology, the Alika runs faster and faster. As Katayama floors the accelerator pedal, the car rockets past the 300 km per hour mark. In this test, the car reaches a top speed of 320 km per hour. For safety reasons, it can't go any faster on this particular track. Later, on a track in Italy, the Alika will reach 370 kilometers per hour. No sedan-type electric car has ever clocked speeds like these. As a further demonstration of the Alika's high performance, Shimizu and his colleagues arrange an acceleration test. Does it really have more power than a car with an internal combustion engine? The Alika's opponent is a Porsche. After working on electric cars a hundred years ago, Ferdinand Porsche began working on cars with internal combustion engines. The company he founded became one of the world's top makers of high-performance sports cars. Can the electric Alika defeat a Porsche, the ultimate in engine-powered cars? Acceleration performance will be measured by the time taken to reach 160 kilometers per hour. They're off. The Alika is the first to reach 160 kilometers per hour. Let's see it again. First, the 
Porsche sprints into the lead. After 3.8 seconds, the Alika matches the speed of the Porsche. Once the speed hits 100 kilometers per hour, the Alika pulls away from the Porsche. The Alika hits 160 kilometers per hour in just 7.04 seconds. At this moment, the Porsche is doing 138 kilometers per hour. The Porsche doesn't reach 160 kilometers per hour until the 9.2 second mark. This is proof that the Alika can accelerate just as well as the fastest engine-powered cars. すごいですね。そうですか。素晴らしいじゃないですか。すごいです。ああ、そうですか。多分酔っちゃう人がそうです。その、ま、電気自動車っていうのは加速が悪いというのが今まで一番の、ま、批判の対象だったわけですけど。